This is my remote temperature humidity sensor project. Uh, this is the sensor unit. So we got the sensor there and the little an antenna sticking out is from the HC12 board which is used for communication with the, this other side which actually displays the information. Uh, at the top uh, basically you can give a name for the room or the location of the sensor and the little red button actually requests the updated information from the sensing unit. It actually sends updates I think every five or ten minutes, I'm not 100% sure, I can't remember, I would need to look at the code. And that's about it, so I'll go through and show you how it all fits together. So for this project the main thing you will need is the HC12 module. I will not go in a detail explaining how to set it up, there's actually quite a lot of tutorials on the internet. And the main thing to remember there is both modules need to be set on the same channel and with the same bitrate. And they will work as a wireless serial bridge. So let's have a look at the sending unit or the sensor unit. So we got DTH11 module here. I, mine is actually on a little board so there's only three pins coming out. Uh, then that is connected to the Arduino Pro and the, for the data transfer to work there is the HC12 module. So now let's have a look at the receiving end. For that I used Arduino Nano and this little 0 0.96 inch OLED display. As you can see it's got only four pins. There's actually another similar screen with a lot more pins but in this project I use this one. I think it's called I2C a type of connectivity or I'm not 100% sure and again we got HC12 module for sending and receiving the data which is just basically connected to the serial port and we have the button where we which can be used to actually request updated information from the temperature and humidity sensor and that is all. I will include the link to the Arduino code for this project and also link to some tutorials how to set up the HC12 module and these layouts. Thank you for watching.